Okay, let's do some math for fun. Today I will show you guys the 22.5, 67.5, and 90 special red triangle. Really cool, so check this out. Here we go. Of course, we are going to do our little construction. I will start off with the rectangle. I would like to have this side to be square root of 2, and I would like to have this side to be 1. This is what we'll do. I will take this one, and I will go from here. I will go down by 1. So I will say it's about right here. How's that? So, I would just like to go down here, and I'll say this is also 1. Then, we can of course come up with a little triangle from here to here, like that. And of course, this is just a typical 1, 1, square root of 2, special right triangle. And of course, this and that will be just 45 degrees. That's nice. And of course, this is the 90. Okay, then what we'll do is, okay, check this out. This is square root of 2. This is also square root of 2. So you can imagine this length and that length are actually the same. Okay, maybe my picture is not so well, but just excuse my picture, right? Then what we'll do is we will just connect from here to here. And the reason is because this is square root of 2. This is square root of 2. And now we have an isosceles triangle. This and that are equal. That means this angle and this angle will be equal. Well, this right here, of course, this is 45 already. Therefore, this right here will also be 45 degrees. And now let's just do the math in our head. This triangle-wise, okay, 180 minus 45, and then divided by 2. You will get this right here being 67.5, and likewise, this is also 67.5 degrees. Very good. And now, Check this out. I'll put this down in blue. Why not? On the bottom right here, you see we have this triangle. And yes, you can see already, huh? The whole thing here is 90. 90 minus 67.5 degrees is precisely 22.5 degrees. And for the angle here, of course, we can just do 180 degrees minus this, minus 90. And this right here will just give us 67.5 degrees, where you can do 180 minus this, minus that. Same thing, right? So, as you can see, this right here, it's actually our special right triangle. And as we all know, see that from here to here is square root of 2. This much is 1 already. That means this blue portion has to be square root of 2 minus 1. And this right here is, of course, just 1. And, of course, I'll also figure out the hypotenuse right here for you guys. And the easiest way to do all this is just the following. I will take the square root, and I'll do this square plus that square. So here we go. And now we can, of course, simplify this a little bit. This right here is the square root. This is, of course, 1, and we add. And we have to just multiply this out. And you get this square, which is just 2. And then you minus... This times that, and also the 2, right? So minus 2 times this and that, so 2 square root of 2. And lastly, you add this square, which is plus 1. And all in all, you see that we have a square root. 1 plus 2 plus 1 is 4. And then minus 2 square root of 2, like this. So this right here is it, and of course, this is the new special special right triangle. And of course, based on this, we can do a lot of things that we want. Sine, cosine, whatever, right? And perhaps the easiest one is just tangent, because we have the opposite over adjacent, which is just one right here. Therefore, I will just put that down right here for you guys. Based on that, we know tangent of 22.5 degrees is nicely equal to this over that. And of course, that's just square root of 2 minus 1. Right? Very, very nice. Okay, if you guys like the question that we just did, then I would highly recommend you guys go check out Brilliant Work. This right here is a math and science website that focuses on problem solving. And here they have these new dating challenges, which contain many different and challenging fun questions for you guys to do. So this is today's challenge. So you and a friend have six bowling balls. Five of them are identical in weight, and one of which is either heavier or lighter. We don't know what's the lowest number that you need to figure out right to guarantee to figure out the different uh, bowling ball and if you guys come here you can sign for a free account and you can keep track of your progress 
So they have tons of questions for you guys to do right here that will occupy your day and make your day productive. And if you guys want more, you can use the link blend.work slash blackpinrepen because this way you guys can get a 20% off discount to their annual premium subscription. And that way you can get access to all of the archive questions and you can also get their courses.